what's up beautiful people welcome back to my channel um and new year new year welcome my name is Ayolo Atobi. in today's video we are going to be doing like a takedown lock takedown video basically how to like take down your locks without cutting your hair like i've had a whole lot of people like complain to me about them not knowing how to like take down locks and stuff like that i do have like a detailed video on my channel about how to make the locks i made this lock here seen on the screen right now in less than two hours and then i also have a video showing you how to like refresh the lock three weeks after i made add the locks in it looked rough and i didn't like it and i still wanted to work it for a longer time so i just decided to like relock it and like make it look finer and cleaner and i also have a tutorial that tutorial up on my channel but the purpose of this um like inserting these two videos is to see exactly how i did it so that you can actually understand how this taking down process is going to be i'm going to link the two videos down in the description box and also um link them at the end of this video just so you can go see them and like clearly understand how i am going to do it now this is the the end result of the old um refreshing thingy look at it well you can go check the video of how i made it before seeing this take down video if you don't see it you can still take it down using the same method just make sure that you follow it step by step i was about to take my hair out and i was like oh let me just um make a take down video as you can see i already took that hair down and then i did not cut off my hair so basically all you have to do is just pull down the lock the extension just pull it down a little bit and then you will see a little extension that you've used to like um that you used to like do the old crocheting thing just pull it out a little bit and then snip it off using um a using a scissors then after you do that you can just pull it down and everything is going to come off now this is if you did the old crochet method this extension that we are removing right now is because of the crocheting method that we used if you didn't use the crochet method and you just did it the way i did it in the beginning all you just have to do is like pull it down and everything will just come down it might be hard but you just have to like keep taking your time to do it i'm going to keep showing you over and over again basically we are doing the crochet method all you have to do is pull down the hair a little bit keep pulling it down till you can get that extension piece that you've used to crochet through your hair when you get it when you see it just pull it out when you pull it out well please be very very careful make sure that you can actually hold it so that you can pass the um scissors around it and you make sure that you are not snipping off your hair in the process that is basically it it is very very easy very very self-explanatory i don't even have to really do this voiceover but i just feel like i need to do it so basically that's just it you don't have to like first cut off the um extension before you start um re like re unraveling it you don't have to like cut off the extension and start unraveling it like you unravel braids just make sure that if you are doing if it was crocheted in if there's a piece that was crocheted into your hair just pull down the extension itself like pull down the lock extension itself then look for the tiny piece of extension that was crocheted in cut it off and then pull it down if you did the first method that i did while i was making the hair i did not do the crochet method i just braided down my hair and then just wrapped the extension around it if that is the method that you did just keep pulling down from the root this you have to be very very careful while you are doing it because it can be very painful so just keep pulling the extension down and then um it will come off it will come off basically so yeah i feel like i have answered most of the questions or i have tried because this is really really um self-explanatory but if you still find it quite difficult to like get it just keep watching and then basically that is just it i just kept doing the same thing over and over and over again okay guys so now we are done with the old takedown process and i promise you that i did not cut off any strand of my hair i actually do have a detailed um 
hair taking down process on my channel already but i just decided to do this just for people that did not see that video so basically when you want to take down your hair of course you know that after you um finish loosening the the lock just still like braids underneath that the extension was attached to now i'm just going to show you how to take that one down as well without actually causing so much breakage to your hair i do have a like a detailed detailed takedown process video but i'm just going to take down one and show you how i went about it so to make this thing easy for me i already made sure that my braider um twisted it not braided the old, like the old thing through if she had braided the old thing through it would have been so difficult for me to take out to be very very honest and i really don't like stress so i just thought i to like braid the roots and then um twist the ends that way it will be very very easy for me to like take out so you have to also put this into consideration if you do not like um taking out your hair i like i detest taking my taking out my hair a lot so i just have to like look for a faster method for me to do um the old taking down process so basically i just um went tired to like use a leave-in conditioner just to like moisturize the hair first because of course the hair is going to be dry might be dry my hair is usually not very very dry when i um when i take it down because i usually moisturize from time to time while my hair is in a protective style basically so yeah i just took out the twist and of course you know that it's going to like um mold no, maybe not mode like it's the curls are really really going to be defined since the thing the thing has been twisted for a while so you just have to take your time to like take down those twists i don't know how to explain it basically if you are making your hair you will understand now for the for the um base area i just go entire to like use more leave-in conditioner just to make sure that it is well saturated and easy for me to detangle after i do that i just um go ahead to like first use my hand then i use like a white twist comb i'm actually using a cutting comb right now just to make sure that i remove all that build up remember that i said in the um relocking video basically that i could not go into the shower to like wash it completely so i just did the old quick fast method right now i am perfectly done completely done loosening my hair if you want to see how i actually take down my braids you should really really check down my takedown video it is very detailed it is very easy very explanatory i broke the whole thing down through the whole process of washing my hair taking it down and like doing everything just go see the video i'm going to link it in the description box as well and baby i loved how my hair was looking after i took down the braids like i was so excited my hair feels healthy it was it was just really giving what i needed it to give basically so i was trying to like comb it out and i was trying to comb it out and then like just to like fluff it out a bit don't forget that my hair is not dry i will not advise you to comb out your hair when it is dry and look at the comb i don't know if you guys can see the comb but that was how much breakage i got all th together like this hair was so low maintenance no stress nothing nothing and look at my hair look at how full this baby is i really really love this so much i it, it was giving me model vibes so i said to do a little modeling poses for you guys i really hope that you enjoyed the video if you do do not forget to give it a big thumbs up it really does 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 help the channel grow you know also subscribe to the channel and join the family it's always interesting juicy in here don't forget to follow me on my social media it is always on the top left corner on the screen and you guys you guys i am so excited about the way my is looking and i will see you people in the next video bye y'all